Hello everyone, this is Ed from Great Hudson Sailing. I'm at the Fountain Peugeot facility in La Rochelle, France. Um, here's an MY4S that just went into the water. I recently did a factory trip and our on water boat is on the line, so we should be having it by the end of the year. Let's take a walk on board the MY4 and see what it's all about. So here's the transom of the MY4S. I'm gonna step on board. The boat has just splashed, so the cushions aren't in place, and we actually just had a rainstorm, so everything's a little bit wet. All the cushions are inside, but let me just show you how easy it is to walk. Um, you have nice wide catwalks, very easy to get around. The, uh, the rails are well above the knees. You have a large area here. Once all the cushions are in place, you have a, a small lounging area. Very easy to walk around. This boat has the optional plancha grill back here. Uh, and the cushions would just occupy all that space there. There's a uh, storage, there's storage for your um, power cables and your propane tank, access to the engines, floor access, another access port to the engines. As we walk inside, you can see the wide opening to walk through. This boat has the electric table that lifts up and down. As I get in, I'm just gonna flip it open. Let's get a nice view of that. So there's a very comfortable dining area right there. Your galley is to port. You have storage back there. Here is a garbage bin, double sink, two burner stove. It's a large storage drawer. Just have it filled up with some stuff right now. Here's a fridge. There's a secondary fridge on the starboard side going down to the guest station, the, the guest accommodations. Here's your panel. So it's right to starboard as you enter the boat. Everything has nice little icons, easily easy to identify. As we walk forward to the helm station, we have a nice double helm seat here with bolsters. You have a little side seat here, so you can really be comfortable with a couple of people keeping you company. Um, just from here, I'm just gonna go around and you can see the visibility And obviously you're nice and protected inside the cabin. This boat has twin Volvos. The, uh, the one on order has the twin 250 horsepowers. Um, they are shaft drives. So the boats, um, we order them with the bow thruster. So between the, the shafts being, you know, probably 10 to 12 feet apart and the, the bow thruster boat is super maneuverable. Uh, let's just take a walk down to the owner's cabin and mind you this boat just splashed so it's not completely set up yet but going forward you have a very large hanging locker right here and then you have Small area with more storage down below. You got shelves. You have a large storage here. There is a separate shower stall. Here's your head, sink.
And behind the door there was actually more storage. There's some nice shelves there. Going aft is the berth. It's a nice wide double berth. Right now a lot of the gear is sitting on it, but comfortable uh, berth, nice window to look out. Very spacious owner's cabin. Let's go over to the other side. So the boat is set up as a maestro. So when the port side is the owner's cabin, it's a maestro. You can split it to double it up, but most people prefer the nice, the nice large maestro version. This one has, here's your forward berth. You have a little sitting area there. You have an, an opening porthole inside a larger window. And once you're inside, there is a hanging locker. And then a double cabinet there. Light switches, receptacle, USB ports. You have a little bit more storage up there. Opening hatch above for ventilation. Here's that secondary fridge I mentioned. So there's a secondary fridge here. Here's the aft cabin. Once again, uh, the metal hardware is for the seats that go forward. We have all our exterior cushions here, similar to the forward cabin where you have storage behind the door. Let's take a peek at the head. So here's your head. And here is your sink and vanity. That's just a quick walkthrough on the MY4S. We will be having one in New York probably by the end of the year. I just figured I'd give you guys an opportunity to see one. Um, if you have any questions, please contact me at ed at greathudsonsailing.com.